everybody, this is Praxis, and I've been here for about half a day, and this wall on the east side is all done being sheathed on this side, and I think it looks pretty nice. Uh, we've got that high window up there, that's going to be one that I don't think will open, it'll just be an extra way of getting light in, and yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure of the surface that it's going to be there, either something uh, translucent that'll diffuse light, or maybe... It looks pretty kind of looks pretty cool being able to look right through it. So if I can get myself access to, you know, glass, then maybe I'll I'll make the window out of that. But for this winter, I think it's just gonna be covered in plastic anyway. Uh, what I'm doing now that I finished up this uh, side is going over to the other side, and I want to bring you over there right now. I don't usually move the camera during these, but we'll see about uh, bringing you over there without having too much nausea being induced here. Uh, what I wanted to talk about is uh, something I've got going on right over here. I'm going to rotate you around. Here we go. And there we are. So uh, we're here over on the uh, opposite side. And this is what that uh, greenhouse looked like this morning. So the fact that I'm halfway through the day, I finished that, and now I've got the other half over here, um, I'm feeling pretty good. I think I'm going to definitely get both of these done and maybe even have a little extra time because I'm a little bit faster now that I've, you know, kind of worked through, you know, how to do it over there, I'm doing the exact same thing over here. Uh, what I wanted to talk about is, is this right here. You can see there are a bunch of these short boards right in here, and uh, all the nails are sticking out on them. Why did I do that? You know, uh, Normally, uh, when I put a board in, I will put the nails in and leave just the top unset. That way, uh, when you slide the next board in, uh, if you set the top nail, sometimes it's hard to get the next board in. So I'll, I'll leave the tops unset, and I'll set the bottom ones in all the way. But for these, I've got all of them open all the way up. Now, why is that? There's a really good reason, and the reason is because whenever you're kind of going up on the side of an opening, uh, you know, window, the boards can drift from each other. On this side, you know, they could pack, because they're so short, they could pack together really tightly. Over on this side, they're longer, there's more, uh, more, there'll be more of a tendency for there to be little gaps. The gaps could add up, and by the time you get to the other side, you could have a significant difference between your boards. So once I uh, started this side, I, I put a couple of nails just in partially, but this whole thing can kind of shift and shimmy around. Uh, the idea being uh, that on this side, there's, like I said, more likely to be gaps. So I may want to introduce gaps on this side so that I don't have, uh, you know, a big deficit at the end and I have to, you know, make huge gaps just on the top board as I try to bring them together. So uh, I just cut, actually, the board that goes in up here. And let's see how it works out. So far it looks pretty good because uh, this line here looks pretty smooth between the two of them. Uh, is that all right? Yeah. Okay. No, I'm doing it backwards. It goes like this. I'm backwards because I had the uh, tongues facing up on the other side, which is more conventional, and tongues facing down on this side. And again, the reason I did that was so that I could more efficiently use my scrap if I kind of alternated back and forth. All right. So here we go. Now this lines up pretty well. There is a gap here, but this, this gap actually is not due to the fact that one is ahead of the other. This gap is due to the fact that this board has a bit of a bend to it. Uh, but overall, I think I can, I can probably set all these boards just as they are. Uh, and then I'm going to have to put some pressure on this thing, pull this down, because it's touching here, touching up there, and uh, yeah, we just got a bit of a, uh, a gap there. Although alternately, alternately what could be happening is that maybe the left side of these boards splayed out a little more and the right side stayed a little tighter, so maybe there's a bit of an angle here. But in any event, I want to tighten that up a little bit, and I'll pull that down. So that's what I'm doing today. I should be able to finish up this wall. Uh, and really, the priority at this point is getting the upstairs uh, done. Now, that, that might make you ask, well, why am I not working on the upstairs? Uh, the upstairs, the work up there is something that Amber can do. Uh, Amber's uh, abilities are limited. Uh, you know, obviously she doesn't have as much experience as I do. So I'm kind of leaving that to her. Anything that I can let someone else do lets me focus on other things. Uh, now, you know, that said, the priority is getting that done and she's not here as, as often as I am. But, uh, you know, we'll see, how, we'll see how it goes. We've got some rain coming up and then I'm gonna be limited to being inside. And if I'm inside, I'm probably gonna be upstairs doing that or I could be wiring up electrical receptacles, one or the other. But uh, for today, with it sunny, I wanna be out here doing this. That's it, thanks for watching.